Just oh, doesn't no. want to look at the tank until he gets it. <laughs> I'm angry. Surprise. And the you fucking US 90 mil will go through. That's fucking right, easy. Uh, let's see. Uh, try and angle your turret. Like, I'm, I'm just right here. How would you, like, normally angle it for me? This, I would imagine. Alright, let's try that. Got the breach. Yeah, which basically means I'm dead at this. Like I said, the US 90 mil will go through easy as fuck. Yeah, I don't know about this thing though, because 142 pen. Hmm. Try it. I'll aim for the left side like I would normally. No, it didn't go through! Well, yeah, because you hit the fucking long ass optic port thing that's there. No, I right. hit to the right of it, it just splashed to the optic port. That would have gone through on a normal Panther. Try and uh, bounce it down. Why don't you shoot CFD an area where that doesn't have the fucking optic port? I went lower shoot? than the optic port. I'm not sure what you hit there. I hit about there. I... Yeah. Okay, let's, let's see. see. Okay, yeah, there's no yeah. space armor there. Where? Oh, yeah. Turret ring. Oh, yeah, that. I, I was gonna I just... say, like, you should probably, like, try to bounce it. Down I was gonna like, try and there. shot trap it, but the angle of the armor on there, and it's so thin that it's not gonna work. You're yeah. just gonna make it so that you're doing less damage to what you do hit. Okay, let's just let's just move back to his spawn side. He hasn't taken the, the journey to the get three back. Crew and the, fucking, the three crew and the fucking... Yeah, the three crew and the turret are all fucking right next to each other. If you hit one of them, you're probably gonna kill all three of them. Unless the breach absorbs everything. The breach is tiny. It won't absorb shit. It won't absorb shit. I like how that. Oh, you know what's really dumb? With AP you know what's really, you know what's really dumb? Collusion. Me what? shooting the space armor gives me hits. <laughs> yeah, it is. We well, yeah, have <laughs> fucking like five millimeters of armor, or fifty cal, or fucking thirty cal from that. Yeah, but that shouldn't like. Am I? I wonder if we, I'd get spawn points for just spamming seven six two at you. Right. Probably. Did that do anything? Not nah, nothing. Okay, I'll try the uh, very right. Get a lower front plate. Okay, so that's not space. a. That's just space armor right yeah. there. There you go. Today. My APHE just went straight through the lower, straight through the transmission. Yeah, well, I mean, you're using a Russian tank. I would expect to. I like how I don't even have like, hardly got a third of, not even a third, a quarter of my fucking ammo in the tank. Uh. -oh. I don't even want to put fucking more than 20 bullets in my tank. Oh, so you, did Asko's gotten two kills on you, yet you still have a, as just as much score from bouncing? Yeah. I only get a lot of score from just bounce, like absorbing these uh, seven like machine gun rounds. I do. <laughs> I just went up like 200 score. <laughs> yeah, that's ridiculous. You're almost at a thousand I, score, dude. I imagine you can't pin the upper front plate for the tank one, unless you shoot the machine gun port. Uh... It did a weird ricochet. Yeah, yeah that was a just... ricochet. Okay. You want me to try with Sabo or no? no you just... don't have Sabo! <laughs> APCR, you know what I mean. Why would you use APCR on a mind you? It's beyond us. I mean, just in case, you know, you never know. I want to see if the space see, armor helps the panther's stupid side armor at some point. Because I was able to pin a panther's side armor from about this angle in Regu one game. Regular AP bounces off the uh, upper front plate. And I'm not sure what it did to the machine. Let's see. Russian 85. No, that actually worked. So I've pinned the side armor with this gun from this angle. Okay, there we go. I assume that was the lower front plate. No, that was, it was an AP through the MG port. Okay, yeah. AP will go right through the MG port. Right. It was weird because the other shots, like, bounced around in between. Like, you'll see, uh... I'll see if I can show you later, but... Like, I shot one part of the MG port and it just, like, bounced around the port and didn't do any damage. Yeah. All the fucking points I've got just from you guys shooting machine guns at me. Because it's counting as penetration damage because you're pinning the 5 mils of armor? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, is it's going to be ridiculous for points. Yeah. It's going to damage try. before it detracts. Yes, 
I mean, it's just the default panther gun, so we know that if I shoot at either of you, it's probably going to crit or damage slash kill. That penetrates right through the transmission as well. Yeah, the transmission. The transmission and the target. The panther just seems to not work. <laughs> it doesn't fucking matter what angle I put this tank at, you'll pin it from. It's like, uh, I'm pretty sure, like, the Russian transmissions are just, like, eat up rounds. I, I do want to do a slightly different test. What would that be? Let me angle the actual hull of the tank a wee bit. Alright. Because I've just been having it facing you, like, straight on the whole time. Yeah, the only problem with angling the hull is the side armor of the panther is not exactly well known for being armored. Well, let, let, let's test that. Bounced off there, but I think that's You bounced cool. off one of his track links. Yeah, <laughs> did that much. I'm just angling against Baron, I'm not counting for Devasco's angles. Well, yeah, because it penning. wouldn't help. What if I turn the turret like this? I mean, you'd probably still be able to paint the turret. The turret's oh, fucking... Manlet. Yeah. I mean, there's I that fucking flat oh, square. I could, I could pen next to the mantlet if it wanted. Yeah, there's I that should, fucking yeah. flat triangle there. Oh, no, I can't! Oh my god, that's so dumb! I wait, figured where, out why. Where, where'd you shoot him? Okay. Shoot at the Don't shoot for the side of the turret, because the space between the turret and the, um, actual turret is large enough to where you'll bamboozle yourself into missing. It's like, I have to aim right next to the mantlet to hit him. Yeah, you've got to hit that little fucking triangle thing, I imagine. Yeah, I... I you have to aim shot, I... just next to it. Yeah, for my shot, when I killed your gunner and everything, I shot kind of above it. And to the right. You mean to tell me, I did 13 fucking challenges for a tank that can still get pinned from the front. I mean, to be fair, we're using, like, the most high-end guns of this video. Yeah. You're basically using what I would fight at like a normal tier slash up tier. Yeah. But if... I want to know what a like 4.7 tank will do against this thing. Well, I think you'll me... know what happens when a jumbo fights it. Oh well, yeah, the jumbo would just fucking be like, what? Unless he gets to the side armor. Hold on, I'm doing some special fucking trying to adjust the thing. Okay, so that's right. I'll just fucking like, uh, I'll just do this. This probably won't work. Fuck it. The front angle. Yeah. This is how I imagine it. Oh, was. oh, that was dumb. What did you do? It's Russian. When do you think it's not dumb? <laughs> it went through the track into the transmission and exploded upwards. Oh yeah, that happens with any fucking tank you fire at. You always goes through the track, through that fucking side armor. And feels damage. like it feels like every time I get my tracks hit in the jumbo, it just automatically like explodes my ammo. Like not even well, yeah, cause... of the flat. Because the armor next to the tracks on the jumbo is only 40 millimeters there. Let me just Not give an example. If I shot Baron for his, or I mean, I shoot him. If I shot through his track here, I he just ate it. Yeah. I just bounced off. Meanwhile, I just do that. I just went sideways straight onto you. All right, I'll, I'll get my 4-7 uh, line up and I'll see how those go. It doesn't model fuel consumption. Um, a yeah. full fuel tank. Um, since it's full, it shouldn't ignite, because there's no oxygen. Wanna see some real Russian bias? Watch this not pin. Nah, <laughs> <didn't mind. laughs> Alright, I'm here with the jump. Watch this! <laughs> Look at this fucking nice 4 km an hour reverse speed. Alright, so I'll sit front onto you. Alright, uh, you wanna try mantlet or upper front? I'll just start with a mantlet. I got a hit mark, but it was just in the, uh... You uh, damage the machine gun. Yes. I'll be there eventually. Yep. It says I slightly wounded your commander that time. Oh, just a wee tiny bit. Yeah, in your gunner. Slightly damaged the gunner that time around. Oh yeah, by the way, I was playing my T-114 okay, so earlier. It's a, two, it's a two top. I bounced a shot from a Yag Tiger. Nice. So it takes a few shots to actually kill something through the mantlet, that is what you're saying. Yeah, I'm gonna try for the MG port now. Yeah, it went pin the upper front plate. Oh, it went through the MG. Yeah, I kind of expected it to go through the MG. Does it go through the lower front plate? Hold on. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> There's your answer. <laughs> Are you firing AP or is it the AP? This is the AP. Or whatever? Let me switch to AP at you. Yeah, so it's just solid AP you're firing, not yeah. the fucking shot. Because that, that round is actually useful now. 
Yeah, but a lot of people still use the fucking M62 or whatever it is. Yeah, because it's like, oh, I want to do damage. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I still use the yeah, AP, M62 AP, AP. shot because it's what I've always used and it's worked for me, but now it's just unreliable. Where'd that go through? APHE yeah? through the MG. Yeah, the MG, I mean, people probably won't shoot for the MG because if I angle the tank, you're not going to yeah, be able to shoot the that. And before this thing's actually just a glass cannon asking to get shot on. <laughs> right, so if I was going to angle against the jumbo, if I was going to angle the MG port, I would probably move it this way. Man, like, why'd you have to make this realistic? It only makes my life more difficult. Well, oh yeah, but you want to you want to the realistic damage model because we play realistic, not fucking arcade. Yeah. If only this was like Overwatch where you could change like the movement speed and like keep the other things. Yeah. Yeah, so with the real custom game then. So AP can't penetrate at that angle. So if it angles, it can't be pinned. What about the turret? Uh, I think that was just the side armor. Is there anything on the turret you can pin? I'd assume that fucking triangle. I got the cannon breach for shooting the top of the mantlet. Okay, so the man looks shit still. Can't penetrate. Is that the 76 or the 75? It's the 75. 75. It's the Cobra King. And it can't pen the triangle with AP. I mean, that triangle is still hardly angle. Who's shooting at the bottom manlet? I can wound your gunner and loader occasionally. No. Yeah, there we go. Maybe. Can you shoot through the lower front plate from me? I imagine you can. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Can you pin oh. the lower front plate from that angle bound? Burn respects the front plate. Hmm. Nah, it just bounces. So if you angle it, it's a bit <laughs> thing's still gonna penetrate your tank. That's what I expected. All right, collision. Oh, let's God. let's see if you can bounce a heat round. <laughs> what? Hold on. What's the Cobra King's frontal armor? Uh, uh, 101, yeah. 102. Just not pinned the front armor of the Cobra King. Yeah, it'll oh. bounce. Friend, let me tell you something real quick. Let me shoot there again. What the fuck? My mouse on angled. I mean, hold on. Let me shoot just a bit higher than where I'm actually shooting. Oh no. You yeah. can pen the MG port on the. Let me try, let me try that you again. Just have to hit it flat. What the nope. fuck? <laughs> See, I w I kind of wish they'd added the um instead of oh. the jumbo. I wish they had added um the Thunderbolt Seven. Wait, Baron, angle the jumbo as best you can? Like how you would normally angle the jumbo against the panther? Okay, so you'd angle it something like that. So anywhere I can actually shoot, go through here. Maybe here? No. Oh. Tracks. I could yeah. go for the track shot, but that's the shot I would make if anybody angled anyway. I want to see if there's anywhere else I can actually pin. Uh, you should be able to just go straight through the gun mantlet at that range. I'd imagine so. Yeah. Or I could go through there. So yeah, the like... gun mount is 177, your pen is 179 if I'm not mistaken. Wait, his upper front plate, except yeah. you shot in my right side. Yeah, I could have shot the right side, but I shot the left heat round. Where can the 76 use your pen? I mean, the 76 is better than the 75, so it could probably pin the same, but in certain areas better. And if you're firing normal AP, it can go through the turret cheek. Yeah. It's legit just a fucking panther, basically. I really want it, though. Just another you panther. Just, you just have slightly improved odds at survivability. 